In this video, we're going to connect a domain to uh, Mailgun for sending and receiving emails, and then we're going to um, connect it inside of Go High Level. So what we want to do here is we want to just copy the new do uh, new domain we purchased. Let's go over to Mailgun and um, let's just um, sorry. Let's go into sending and let's go into add a new domain. Uh, you always want to put something in front of the domain. Uh, I use uh, replies because that's what's going to show up in emails being sent out. Uh, so I put replies dot contest hyphen and I just use the domain. Make sure there's no spaces. Add the domain. <laughs> okay. So now it's given us what we need. Text records, MX records, and CNAME records that we need to add to um, Namecheap to this domain. So let's go back here and it says, look, create a text record with this information. So I'm just gonna copy uh, replies, copy that. And we're gonna go here and we're gonna create a add new and this is gonna be a text record. And this is gonna be replies. Let's come back here, let's copy this box right here. Just click this, come back paste click check okay let's come back here and it says use this now mail donkey and always use the replies always use the this other end of it as well don't miss that even though it's not highlighted trust me when i say this is after a little bit of experience and watching others struggle this is what you need to do come back let's copy this box this is really easy stuff if you just follow these instructions. Okay, so we've added the two text records. Now we have to add two MX records. Let me just bring this tab over here. Uh, so now it says MX records, and again, it's going to be uh, replies. Copy. So we're going to come in here. Uh, let's come down here. Email forwarding. We're going to go custom MX. Again, this is name cheap, so I'm not sure what everybody else is using, but... So we're using that replies. We're going to copy this and the priority is going to be 10 for both. So let's paste that in 10. So this is MXA and then we have to add in MXB <coughs> save. <coughs> add new record MX. Uh, it's also replies. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, we're going to copy this one, and again, it's 10. Paste, so MXB, MXA, priority 10. Check. And then it says create a CNAME record, and this one is going to be, we're going to grab email plus replies, okay? Copy. Let's come back here. Let's go up top, and let's add in a new CNAME record. <laughs> Pop that in and let's come back and let's grab this box here. Copy that. Come back over here. Okay, let's check that. Okay, so we've done these two steps, these two steps, and this step. Okay, this is really simple. So I'm going to verify, and sometimes it takes a little bit of time. So you can see one, two, three, four have been verified, one more. So we'll click it again. And bingo, it's done. So, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm going to come back up here to, to sending. I'm going to find that uh, domain we just added. Uh, give me a second here, contest. I'm going to click on it. Um, sorry, I'm going to come down to dashboard. Sending. I'm going to come down to domain settings. That's the URL. And we have to turn click tracking on so people so you can see the links they're clicking inside of uh, your landing pages or your forms open tracking and unsubscribes unsubscribes are when you send the email out it's going to have on the bottom click to unsubscribe you have to have that okay so we're going to turn this on that's on we're going to turn this one on and we're going to turn this one on 
probably one of the most important ones. That's done. All right, so now we're gonna come back into Go High Level. You're gonna come back into your master account, so just the main account. Under settings, you're gonna come into mail gun settings. And now you wanna to go to your um, account, Oxford, in this case, Oxford Learning. Uh, we're gonna click this edit button and click, see right now it's under our agency. We're gonna change that to this one. So now the replies go in uh, from here. We're gonna save that. And then we're also gonna turn on this, which is email validation. And it just helps <coughs> protect the domain from getting um, recognized as a spam provider. Okay, that's that's really how simple it is um, to to set that up. Okay, thanks.